Hi everyone, it's Anna here and thanks for coming back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be doing a 7 day review on the new Wishful Get Even Rose Oil. So if you guys want to see what I think about this rose oil after 7 days, then you're in the right place. But before we get into this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because I do post new videos here every week. Also make sure to go ahead and follow me on Instagram at the Hanali because I'm always posting way more stuff on Instagram if I'm not posting here on YouTube. But without further ado guys, let's get into getting even with Wishful's rose oil. All right guys, so in today's video, I wanna talk about the new Get Even Rose Oil by Wishful Skincare, which in turn is by Huda Beauty. Now this does retail for $63, which is definitely a hefty price for our oil, but there are a lot of claims on this oil. Huda is always talking, is always talking about it on Instagram, how this is just a very transformative skincare product for her. This did so much for her and she definitely does have some trials and results on her Instagram page that she has been sharing. So I'm really interested to see how this oil does and I wanted to share it with you guys. Generally, I didn't want to do like a first impression video or anything like that. With skincare, you can't really test anything out in a day or one time to know whether it's good or not. I just always think those kind of videos baffle me a little bit. So I was like, you know what, if I'm going to do any kind of review, maybe let's do a week review just because a lot of testimonials she's been posting on her wishful instagram page have been either oh this have this is how it looks after a week this is how it looks after 10 days i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my little vlogging that i did and then we can get into the nitty-gritty of what i think about this product let's just go ahead and read what the claims are for the get even rose oil by huda beauty so on the box it says it's gentle simple effective and it locks helps lock in moisture it nourishes the skin it helps with smoothing even skin tone I know it helps with fading dark spots and helping with stuff like that as well. And the main four ingredients that it's really showcasing is rose, carrot seed, rose hip, and balba. Balba? I'm not that. I hope I don't mess that, which I probably did, but. So yeah, those are the main ingredients it's showcasing on the box and on her Instagram. It says that it's for all skin types, normal, dry, combination, oily skin. It also really concentrates on dryness, dullness, and loss of firmness, elasticity. Huda has also nicknamed this as her magic oil. And this is 1.0 fluid ounces, and this retails for $63. Thought I just put that in there. Those are the claims of this oil. But before we get into what I think about it, what my experience after seven days of using, using this oil we're gonna go into the clips first so let's get into it okay guys so it is actually technically day three your girl forgot to film day one and day two but it's okay it's okay i got day three for you so i actually already went ahead and applied the get even rose oil on my skin i totally forgot that i wanted to film the process but then <laughs> i was so into my skincare because skincare for me is like self-care it's like my time my peace so i completely forgot to pick up the camera and film but i went ahead and applied this all over my face as you can see there is a little bit of a shiny dew on my skin and i made sure to really massage it into the skin i also applied it to my neck because i do have some dark spots here that i really want to help kind of fade away and see if they go away so i'm really hoping i have high hopes for this but yeah so this is day three I'm really excited to see how this little review goes, but yeah, so I guess I will check in with you guys on day four. All right, guys, so it is now day four of me trying out the new Get Even Rose Oil by Wishful Skincare right here. So I just want to show you guys how I apply it. A lot of people, when they see droppers, they like to apply it to their skin. That's really not a good thing because whatever germs are on your skin and you put it back, it's it's kind of icky. So what I do is I just push out some product. It's an oil, so you definitely have to work pretty quick. So it does get a little bit messy. Apply that down on my neck. And you just want to kind of lightly massage it. I like to do it in circular motions. So yeah, but today is day four and that is kind of how I apply it onto my skin. And yeah. So, I'll see you on the next day. <laughs> okay guys, it is now day five of this review on the Get Even Rose Oil from Wishful Skin Care. So I'm gonna apply this on my skin. And yeah, let's get to it.
All right, everyone, it is now the last day. It is day seven of this review. My hair is a mess, but we're gonna ignore that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and apply the Get Even Rose Oil by Wishful Skin on my face. Best one. So I like to just go in circular motions into my skin. And then obviously my main concern that I have are these dark spots on my neck. It does eventually get absorbed, but it definitely leaves and it makes your skin look a lot more shiny. All right guys, so that was seven days of me trying out the Wishful Get Even Rose Oil. Now you wanna be like, Hella, tell us, what do you think about it? Okay, so to be 100% clear with any skincare product you use, you really wanna use it for at least a good month to get a real good idea whether or not it's working for you or not. But because she is sharing testimonials on her Instagram page of a lot of her team, uh, a lot of people on her team using it for seven days, 10 days, 30 days. I was like, okay, why not show you guys a seven day review and then maybe I can update it from there. But comparing my before and after pictures of before the seven days and now at the end of the seven days, I will say my dark spots, especially on my neck, have faded. And those dark spots you see, I've been dealing with those for like the last month now and I've been using the Ule Hendrickson Dark Spot Toner and nothing is helping it fade away. So I will say it is definitely helping with dark spots. So I can definitely see those dark spots going away within the next week or so because it's significantly made them look less, you know, they're, they're almost, they're, they're getting close to being gone soon. So I've seen a very big difference with dark spots when it comes to this oil. When it comes to the actual texture of my skin, Honestly, not really, just because I do deal with a lot of pitted acne scarring and large pores. So for me, they look pretty much the same. So I don't really see a difference with that. But for the other claims, I can't really attest to that just because I don't think it's been enough time. I think I would definitely need to review this for a good full month or so to give you the real nitty gritty of the other claims. But for dark spots, I think so far for a week, it's definitely helped diminish the appearance of my dark spots. My, so with Huda Beauty and her wishful products, anything with Huda related, I, I definitely think fragrance is always a big question. And yes, it does have a pretty potent fragrance. I'm trying to see what it smells like. I'm not really sure, but it does have a pretty strong fragrance and it does linger when you apply the oil. So if you're not a fan of fragrance, don't do it. <laughs> you won't like it. It lingers. Another thing I want to mention, I did talk, I did ask two estheticians that I know. One of them, she never got a chance to get back to me, but the other one, she got back to me. And I, I wanted to ask them like before I do this review, is it okay for me to use this? So she says that she's she she's definitely heard of people using rose hip oil and stuff like that. And she's like face oils in general, which she's recommended me one face oil before. So that's why I was like, okay, maybe it's a face oil, it should be fine. She said the only ingredient that really she was concerned about is that they had alcohol. I think it was like the fifth thing down the ingredient list. She was like, I'm kind of surprised why they had alcohol in the ingredients. So she was a little skeptical about the product when she saw the alcohol. She knows that I don't really get irritated with fragrance. She said it was fine. But the only thing that was a little concerning to her was why it had alcohol in it. I wanted to go ahead and try it anyways. Now, I know Huda on the Wishful Packaging it says to use it for AM and PM. She actually, my, my esthetician friend actually told me don't do it in the morning, just apply it in the evening. Just because in the morning you do want to keep your skincare a little bit more simple. Because I already go in with just a cleanser, I do niacinamide, and I do my vitamin C serum, and I do moisturizer and SPF. So I just specifically use this for your nighttime skin routine, just add it in there. So I added it in my nighttime skin routine, and she actually told me to use it after my niacinamide, but again, I kind of went with Wishful's instructions. They said to apply this after the moisturizer, so I did that at nighttime. I applied it after my moisturizer. It did feel kind of weird because they always say to go from the thinnest to thick, so usually that's why you kind of leave moisturizer last. I followed Wishful's instructions and used it afterwards, even though my friend, she said not to, but you know. <laughs> so as of right now, for after a seven day review of this get even rose oil i would say the only con i have mm, i would say the two cons i have is the fragrance and just kind of question well why there's alcohol in this i mean as a normal consumer myself and i wasn't really looking into ingredients i probably wouldn't even notice the alcohol and i would ignore it just because i kind of do look at ingredients as myself and when she mentioned it i was like mm, 
that's true why is there alcohol in here but aside from that i've definitely seen a big difference in my dark spots so i'm gonna continue using this for sure i really want to see what else it does for my skin and the only reason i know this is what helped my dark spots is because the other products i've been using i've been using for so long because i love them but i know introducing this was the only thing i introduced <laughs> the last seven days so i know this is what helped with the dark spots that i have right here so yeah but already guys that is it for this video i hope i could be as helpful as possible and let me know if you guys will be getting the new wishful get even rose oil this very hefty 63 dollar rose oil let me know down in the comments below also make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because i do post new videos here every week go ahead and follow me on instagram at the henna ali because i post a lot of stuff on here when i'm not posting on here yes all right guys that is it for this video i hope to see you guys in the next one all right thanks bye